Hello friends, I am Santosh. Welcome to online stratification. Friends, in most of the competitive exams and placement exams, students feel difficulty in finding square roots. But trust me friends, finding square root is a very simple task and you no need to do paperwork also. If you apply techniques, then you can solve in less than 3 seconds. Okay. Let's make some important points. 2 square is equal to 4 and 4 is unit digit. Okay, 3 square is 9 and unit digit is also 9. Okay, 4 square equal to 16 and 6 is unit digit. 5 square equal to 25 and 5 is unit digit. 6 square equal to 36 and again 6 is unit digit. Okay, 7 square equal to 49 and 9 is unit digit. Okay, 8 square equal to 64, 4 is unit digit. 9 square is 81, 1 is units digit. 10 square equal to 100 and here 0 is unit digit. One important point to be noted is 2 square equal to 4, okay, 4 is units digit. 8 square equal to 64 and again 4 is units digit, okay. 3 square equal to 9 and 9 is units digit and same with 7 square equal to 49 and again 9 is units digit, okay. 4 square equal to 16, 6 is units digit and again with 6 square equal to 36, again 6 is units digit. Friends, you need to remember only these last digits, okay. You need to remember only units digit because we are going to apply techniques based on units digit only, okay. Let's take some problems so that concept becomes very clear to you. Let's take an example. We shall take an example of root of 1, 5, 2, 1, okay. So what will be the first step? We need to note this last digit, okay. This will be first step, okay. So where is 1 here in last digit? It is here. Okay, for 9 square 81 and 1 is last digit. Okay, so what you have to do, select this 9. Okay, place. Okay, next important step is strike out 21. Okay, last two digit you have to strike out and you will remain with again two digit that is 15. Okay, check in this table where 15 lies. 15 lies between 9 and 16, that is, it lies between 3 square and 4 square. Okay. In this step, what you have to do is, you need to select lower limit, that is 3, okay, so place 3. That means, root of 1521 is 39, okay, so this is the answer. I hope you understood the technique. We shall take one more example. We shall take an example of root of 5184, okay. So, can you tell me what is first step as we have already discussed in the example? First step is, take this first step last digit that is 4 okay it's a unit digit you have to select it okay so where is 4 here 2 square equal to 4 okay and again 8 square equal to 64 okay so for 8 square also it is 64 4 is a last digit and for 2 also for 2 square also it is 4 again it is units digit so in this case what you have to do take 2 also and take 8 also okay now next important step is again with again same step that is you need to strike out 84 Okay, that is last two digit and you will remain with two digit that is 51. Okay, so where 51 will lie? 51 will lie between 49 and 64. That is, it lies between 7 square and 8 square. As I have already said you, we need to select lower limit that is 7. Okay, so place 7. So what you got now? 72 or 78. Okay, we got 72 or we got 78. Okay. So, either one of these is definitely true, but which one is true, we need to identify that. Okay, so how to identify 75, that is in 75, we need to write because it is in between 72 and 78. Okay, so what we have to do next, just multiply this 7 with its higher number, that is 8. 7 8 is 56. Okay, now you compare this 51 and 56. Okay, 51 is smaller. Okay, if you get this, this number as a small then you need to select smaller number from these two okay which is smaller in these two it is 72 okay so answer for this is 72 okay that is root of 5184 is 72 okay i hope you understood this let me explain you once again root of 5184 okay last digit is 4 okay check in this table where is 4 2 square is also 4 and again 8 square is also 64 again 4 is last digit so what we have done we have taken this 2 and we have taken this 8 and we have written here 2 and 8 okay and what we have done next slash this strike of this last two digit that is 84 okay we have removed 
uh, we have discarded last two digit and we remained with again two digit that is 51 okay now in table check where 51 lies 51 lies between 49 and 64 okay that is for 7 and 8 what we have to do we need to select lower limit that is 7 okay so right 7 72 and we got 78 okay one of these two number is definitely true we need to select uh, perfect number okay so how to select that one we need to write middle number 75 and this with this, with this 7 we need to multiply with its higher number that is 8 okay 7 it's a 56 okay now you compare this 51 and 56 okay if you find this number small okay then you need to select smaller number from these two okay that is 72 okay so root of 5184 is 72 i hope you understood this we shall take one more example we shall take an example of root of 15129 okay can you tell me what is first step again same we need to select last digit that is 9 so where is 9 for 3 square it is 9 and again for 7 square also it is 9 okay so what we have to write here we need to write 3 and again 7 also we need to write because for 7 also it is 49 last digit is 9 and for 3 it is 9 okay 9 is also last digit okay so we have we have taken 3 also we have taken 7 also okay next step is strike out last two digit okay and we remained with 151 okay we remained with 151 and check where 151 will lie so 151 will not lie in this table we shall take next highest squares that is 12 square equal to 144 okay and 13 square equal to 169 okay we need to select one of we need to select one of these numbers how to select we need to take lower limit that is 12 okay so write 12 so what we got now 123 and we got 127 okay we need to select one of these numbers so how to select take middle number that is 125 and we got 12 this 12 should be multiplied with its higher number that is 13 okay so 12 into 13 we have to make so what is 12 into 12 it is 144 okay just add again 12 with this so that it is equivalent to multiplying 12 into 12 into 13 okay 144 plus 12 is 6 and 5 and 1 156 so check this 151 and 156 this number this number is smaller 151 in that case you need to select smaller number that is 123 okay that means root of 15129 is 123 i hope you understood this so this is the answer we shall take one more example we shall take an example of root of 18769 okay root of 18769 can you tell me what is the first step we need to take this last digit okay for 3 square it is 9 and again for 7 square it is 49 okay so we need to select both numbers 3 and 7 okay and then strike off last two digit and you will remain with three digits okay so where this 187 will lie it lies between 13 square equal to 169 okay and 14 square equal to 196 so it lies between 13 and 14 what you have to do we need to take lower limit that is 13 okay so write 13 so what we got now 133 or 137 okay one of these numbers we have to decide which one is true okay so let's write middle number that is 135 okay this 135 okay multiply this 13 with its higher number that is 14 okay as you already know 13 square is 169 so plus 13 what you will get 9 3 12 1 carry forward 6 1 7 7 1 8 and this one 182 okay so 187 and 182 you have to compare and comparing 187 is larger in that case you need to select larger number that is 137 so root of 187 69 is 137 so answer for this is 137 i hope you understood this okay if you have any doubt means you can comment in comment box okay and i will answer them okay friends now it is your turn to answer these two questions okay write your answer in comment box okay i hope you understood this technique if you like this video do click like button and please do share the video if you have not subscribed do hit subscribe button to get more interesting video subscribe the channel thank you have a nice time take care